Carolyn Spencer Brown, editor in chief of CruiseCritic.com, and welcome to day eight of our Disney Magic Mediterranean cruise. Best Possible Sea Day is a great blend of a little bit of relaxation and indulgence, and also some, some fun kind of activities that, that keep you entertained and, and energized. Today we took a galley tour and we went behind the scenes to see where our food comes from every night and every day in the dining room. Did you know that they have three different dining rooms and basically three different galleys? So these waiters who travel with you from dining room to dining room have to juggle learning new galleys every night of the week. And uh, that's pretty impressive when you consider the great level of service we've had. Entertainment is definitely the biggest thing that makes Disney Cruise special. It's um, the shows are of a quality that you will not get anywhere uh, but here or perhaps on Broadway. And this is a theater that is incredibly sophisticated, whether it's lighting or it's actual movement of different parts or it's props or it's scenery or costumes. You know, when we first started out on this cruise, I, I, I didn't know two things. The first thing, I didn't know that my husband was a closet Disney fan. The second thing I wasn't sure of is as much as I grew up with Disney and like Disney, I'm not necessarily the traditional Disney cruise traveler and I was worried that I'd get a little overwhelmed by the Disney uh, influence on board this ship and I have to say you can have as much Disney fun as you want. Like last night, the Pirates in the Caribbean was so joyful and boisterous and fun. But you walk next door to the quiet cove area, the adult only pool area, and you're on a whole other ship that has nothing to do with Disney at all. So tomorrow we head to Corsica, which is a French island in the Mediterranean. Mm -hmm. 